What's going on guys? Back at it again with another Fallout 4 video. So in the last video we basically left off right before we went to a city called Concord. Uh, and the reason we were going to go to Concord is because we met a robot called uh, Codsworth. And Codsworth had told us that we should potentially look for our missing son uh, over in Concord because there might be some living people there. Uh, the furthest we got, though, was to this little red rocket, uh, gas station, if you will, uh, where we met our first companion, who was Dogmeat. And that's actually pretty fantastic, man. I love this game. I've played it before, full disclosure, so I know everything that's coming, but, uh, in this video, we're basically just gonna continue on. We're gonna go into Concord and find out what mysteries, if you will, are hidden in Concord. So... If you're excited for this video, do me a huge favor, drop a like on this video because it really does help me gauge what kind of videos or content you guys like to see here on the channel. So with that being said, let's get on with this video. What's up, dog? Uh, oh, there's actually a stim pack and blood pack. There's another one right here, actually. If I remember correctly, I think there might be another one on this thing. Yep, there it is. Awesome. All right, let's go ahead and take this junk i don't need any of this man to be honest um let's go ahead we'll craft and we will actually scrap the pipe we'll scratch th scrap that uh this is only a double barrel so we'll scrap that we'll keep the pistol on us and the rest of this junk as a matter of fact we will put it in the workshop oh wait no that's not what i wanted i wanted to transfer and then store all junk there we go. Now we should be good to go. Uh, we do have the some of the creation club stuff in our inventory now that I think about it. Like the Doom Marine armor. But that's not very lore friendly in my opinion. We will put on the backpack though. Oh, the Morgan space suit as well from Prey, I believe. It's a very beautiful suit, man, to be honest. But again, not very lore friendly. So I'm not really worried about it. I'm not going to put it on or nothing. Right now, I'm just going to keep on my typical vault suit and um and my my nice little backpack that we have here go <laughs> almost sniper with pistols dude i swear but of course like i've said previously i'm actually kind of going with an automatic rifle build oh we made it to concord ah getting some weird hitching here uh oh I see you can I snipe him from here oh no he's moving he is on the move and on the prowl all right let's go ahead and search this dude real quick because I do want his leather chest piece uh okay apparel leather chest piece let's go hey guy Get out of my way. Oh, what the fuck? Where did this guy come from? Oh, he's got a leather right leg. Let's go ahead and take that too, as a matter of fact. Get over here. Man, the game is hitching for some reason. I'm not entirely sure why. Uh, I don't really want any of this. Hey, you. Hey, you. Dog beats got him. Uh, any leather stuff? You don't. Hey, up here, on the mountain. I've got a group of settlers inside. The raiders are almost through the door. Grab that laser musket and help us, please. Yes, sir. Uh, stim pack for sure. Uh, nothing else spectacular. I will definitely take this laser rifle. Um, if I can get this last fusion cell. Fusion cell and militia hat. I don't really want the scavenger outfit, but I'll take it anyways. Um, but I will put on that hat because I think it increases per, uh, char uh, charisma. There we go. Alright, cool. Sometimes this guy ends up having the Minuteman outfit, which I kind of wish he had versus the scavenger outfit. But, oh well. Wait, as a matter of fact, let's unfavorite this uh, right bumper. 
No, wait, right bumper. And then we'll favorite the laser musket for now. There we go. All right, we're good to go. Let's get let's get her done. These raiders are gonna for, they're gonna regret ever attacking these settlers or whatever they are. They seemed like nice people. They looked like they were basically just trying to defend themselves. So we shall see. All right. Hello. Ready, set, go. There's another one up here. Stay still. Oh, <laughs> that guy literally blew up, dude. All right. The cool thing about making an automatic VATS uh, build is that you get a pretty good rifle pretty early in this game. Uh, leather chest piece. I already have a leather chest piece. I don't want any of the other stuff. All right, but something we can do is hack this thing since it's just a novice lock. Yes, I know. All right, let's go. Likeness zero. Likeness two. All right, I'm the worst hacker in the in the planet, so I basically just do the guessing game until I get it right. <laughs> Sometimes it backfires though because sometimes it literally takes forever. And I don't like to do I like to leave the last guess alone. Uh because it resets. And you can just get back in it immediately. Ooh, booty's always the answer. Damn it. That's it. There we go. Unlock security gate. Get out of my way, dog meat. Oh, sorry, you're not dog meat yet. You're just dog. You will be dog meat here shortly, though. Uh, what's in here? Psycho buff out. This is just stuff that I can sell. I'm not really into the whole drugs in this game. Come on, baby. Give me some leather right arm. That works for me. Um, so what do I need? I need left arm and left leg. If I could get both of those, man... I'll have a full set of leather armor and that'd be amazing. I'm telling you, man, let's just get the hell out of here. Hey. Oh god. Ready, set, go. Got him. Uh no, that's a raider right leg. Alright, just making sure I still had... Well, I mean that I did have... Uh, Argent Plasma, that's from another Creation Club thing. Stealth Boy, you say? Alright, let me see... You know, that melon will come in handy, as a matter of fact, here shortly. Leather right arm? I already have a right arm. You're giving me the wrong things, game. I need left arm and left leg. Surprise! Goodbye. Oh, nice. All right. Okay, there we go. Left leg, leather left leg. Very nice. Let's definitely equip that. So I just need a left arm. If I can, if one of those other raiders have a left arm, dude, I will be extremely happy. Um, bottle cap, shotgun, nothing. All right, left. Freaking leg. Oh my god. Talk about amazing. Oh, wait. No. Wait, what? Oh, I need a left arm. Stupid. All right. Who cares? Let me read this. It includes the Atomic Command holotape. Very nice. Man, I don't know who you are, but Judge Hammond's impeccable. Preston Garvin, Commonwealth Minuteman. God damn it. Hey, I'm glad to help. Glad to help. Well, if that's true, we could use some more goodwill. As you can see, we're in a bit of a mess here. Maybe... Um, who are these people anyways? Who are these people? Just folks looking for a new home, a fresh start. I've been with them since Quincy. 
Lexington looked good for a while, but the ghouls drove us out of there. A month ago, there were 20 of us. Yesterday, there were eight. Now we're five. It's just me, the Longs, Marcy and June. That's all Mama Murphy on the couch. And this here is Sturgis. Hey. Damn, dude. That sounds tough. Sorry. Sounds rough. Thanks. Nah, that ain't it's good to meet someone who really cares. Anyway, we figured Concord would be a safe place to settle. Those raiders proved us wrong. But maybe? Well, we do have one idea. <sighs> nope. Yeah, for sure, dude. That's amazing. One good idea can make all the difference. Sturgis, tell him. There's a crashed vertebrate up on the roof. Old school. Pre-war. You might have seen it. Well, looks like one of its passengers left behind a seriously sweet goodie. We're talking a full suit of cherry T-45 power armor. Military issue. What? No way. That's amazing. I love it. I like it. <laughs> yeah, I thought you might. Protection with an added bonus. Get the suit. You can rip the minigun right off the vertibird. <laughs> Do that. And those raiders get an express ticket to hell. You dig? Yeah, dude, that's a that's a great idea. Minigun. Now we're talking. I know, right? Only there's one hitch. The suit's out of juice. Damn it. Probably been dry for a hundred years. It can be powered up again. But we're a bit stuck. Well, how can I help? I'll help if I can. What you'll need is an old pre-war FC, a standardized fusion core, your high-grade long-term nuclear battery used by the military and some companies way back when. And we know right where to find one. But we can't get to the damn thing. It's down in the basement, locked behind a security gate. Look, I fix stuff. I tinker. Bypassing security ain't exactly my forte. You could give it a shot. Actually, I already have one. Actually, I already grabbed the fusion core. We're set. Well, all right. Maybe our luck's finally turning around. Once you jack the core into the power armor and grab that minigun, those raiders will know they picked the wrong fight. Good luck. Hell yeah, all right. Uh, well, first things first. Let's pick up, wait. Uh, yeah, he's a good dog. He's a good dog. Smart, too. Oh, indeed. Dog makes good at finding folks who need him. And he'll stick by you now. I saw it. What do you mean, you saw it? You saw it? It's the chems, kid. They give old Mama Murphy the sight. Been that way for as long as I can remember. Um, the site? What's the site? I can see a bit of what was and what will be, and even what is right now. She's terrifying looking. And right now, I can see this something coming, drawn by the noise and the chaos. And it is angry. What is it that you're talking about? What is it? Mama Murphy, I need more, please. I'm I'm sorry, Aww, man. kid. But I just don't know. The sight ain't always clear. But believe me when I tell you it ain't a radar. I'm tired now. And if I ain't mistaken, you've got a job to do. Yes, I do. Man, that's great. I well, it that's like the downside of having low charisma is that uh speech checks don't always work out, do they?
It's all good though. I'm not really worried about it for this character. Right now, I just kind of want to play. Do some other stuff in the process, you know? Maybe do some side quests. We might actually do some side quests after we do a few of these main storyline missions. These loading screens are ridiculous. What is going on right now? I should have, uh... So I have an SSD on my PC, and I got obviously a hard drive. Some of the game, well actually the majority of the games I install, I put it on my hard drive. This was one of the games that's on my hard drive, so I kind of wish that I had uh, put this on my SSD so that the, um... The game would load significantly faster, you know? But, it's all good. Alright, let's collect this cap stash. Woohoo, 20 caps, don't mind if I do. Let's listen to this. Personal log, United States Army Staff Sergeant Michael Daly. This past Saturday, October 23rd, while en route to West Stockbridge, a vertebrate crashed into the roof of this museum. The cause, EMP following nuclear detonation. Several, in fact. From the intel I've gathered, this was a global day after that. Flaherty and Kanawa were shot by some scared desperate survivors. Then Brzezanski took off running. Haven't seen him since. Now, it's my turn to go AWOL, if that concept even applies anymore. My armor's fusion core is burned out, so I guess my soldiering days are done. I'm heading to Boston, on foot, to see if my sister survived all this. She's got an apartment on Boylston Street. This is Mike Daly, signing out. Good luck. And God bless America. Or what's left of it. Damn, that's that's sad. Up here. Hell yeah. Boss, we got somebody up here. Yes, you do. Let's go ahead and reload and then turn him on a lot of people can get past my I'm over here, man. I'll give you that. Goodbye, Gristle. And I gotta level up. Don't mind if I do. Dude, we just destroyed these people. What do I need? I need a left arm, don't I? Nothing yet. Oh, I'm not worried about you right now, alright? Alright, no left arm. You! You! Oh no! Alright, let me see. Oh god. Run! It's a death claw. I'll let that death claw take care of the other guys. Oh, what the fuck? That was close. What am I looking for? Left arm, I think. They broke my freaking arm. Alright, let's go ahead and... Oh no, my dog. Woo! Sorry, dog meat. You're gonna have to wait a second. Alright? Oh god. Run away! Get in the house! Where is he? Let's see if we can get this to this guy really quick. Now that's a raider left arm. I need a leather left arm. Where's this other raider that I keep hearing? I'm not sure. But he's definitely around here. Or she technically is around here somewhere. Oh shit! Run! Okay. Screw you, lady. Ah! <laughs> Get in there. <laughs> Let's go 
we had to use a stim pack before we die. Uh, actually, you know what? If we level up, will that help? Let's go ahead, put it in commando. We'll start leveling this up now. And of course, Grounder. That will definitely come in handy in the long run. Also, mm, I think I kind of want to, actually, I think that's all the level ups I have right now. Where'd he go? Okay, well, it didn't heal me. So let's go over here, uh, stim pack. He's dead, isn't he? Or she? Run away! My god, dude, this is dangerous. Dangerous times we're living in. Oh, I see you. Man, I think I could bait him. Come on, guy. I'm right here. Guy? Do I have any grenades to throw? Because he's literally just right there. I have Molotovs. Oh no. Oh no. I got stuck on something. Fuck. Luckily for us, the game auto saves every time you level up. So we're literally still here. All right, she's dead. Run away! No, I'm out of AP. Oh my god, that was scary. What's up, buddy? Come on. Wait, let's go ahead and put that Molotov back on. Start chucking some of these. There we go, we got him. What I should do, honestly, is aim for his legs. That might be a little tougher than I thought. Right now, I think I got the, the bait technique. Is that good? Is that a good throw? It is. Will you stop throwing rocks at me, rude? What's up, Cla Mr. Claw? Goodbye. Woo, we were almost out of ammo. We destroyed that guy though. All right, something I do want to do though really fast is check this body over here to see if uh No, give me this. To see if he's got a le uh, she's got a leather left arm. No, I keep getting left legs, man. I don't want a left leg. I want a left arm. What about this lady? See, another left freaking leg. What's up, dog meat? Glad you're still with us. All right, so let's go back and check in with these, with the Prestonians. Hell yeah. These loading screens really are long. Even on Fallout 76, man, Fallout 76 has some really long loading screens too. Probably not as bad as this one though, to be honest. Kind of seems like this one has some really ridiculously long loading screens, but hey, what do I know? What's up, man? We're Take good. Easy, mama. You okay? I'm fine, Preston. 
quit us in. What's up? Hi. That was a pretty amazing display. I'm just glad you were on our side. Uh, feelings mutual, man. Feelings mutual, Preston. You can never have too many friends. Not in the Commonwealth. Listen, when we first met, you said you were glad to help. Well, you did. And we owe you our lives. So here, yeah, it ain't much, but it's the best way I can say thank you. What you got? 100 bottle caps, 50 fusion cells? Don't mind if I do. Uh, you're very welcome, buddy. You're welcome. Anytime. Well, since you say that, maybe you'll come to Sanctuary with us. We could use your help getting settled there. Yeah, of course. All right, Garvey. I'm in. Oh, that's wonderful. But there's more to your destiny, isn't there? I've seen it. And I know your pain. Uh... Something's definitely up with her. Please help me. Please, tell me. I need to know. You're a man out of time. Out of hope. But all's not lost. I can feel your son's energy. He's alive. Thank goodness. I knew it. Please, tell me where he is. I need to find my son. I can't see him. Not clearly. But I feel his life force. He's out there. And even I don't need the sight to tell you where you should start looking. The great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Diamond City. The biggest settlement around. Diamond City? What's in Diamond City? Is Sean there? Look, kid. I'm tired now. Maybe you'll bring me some chems later. The sight will paint a clearer picture. No. Mama Murphy, we talked about this. That junk. It's gonna kill you. Ah, shush, Preston. We're all gonna die eventually. We're gonna need the sight. And our new friend here, he's gonna need it too. Now let's get going. Sanctuary awaits. All right, folks. Thanks to our friend here, it's safe to move out. We're heading for that place Mama Murphy knows about. Sanctuary. It's not far. She knows about it? You mean she had one of her visions while she was stoned <laughs> out of her gourd? And now you want us to just head out on another wild goose chase based on no better plan than Mama Murphy saw it? It can hardly oh, hold turn on, out hold any on. worse than... Everybody just take it easy. We're all in this together, right? So Marcy, you got a better idea of what we should do next? Anybody? Well then, sanctuary it is. You know, Sturgis... Let's just hope it lives up to its name. Sturges is an amazing on, character, dude. Oh, okay. Keeping everybody together. And it's very, very easy easy to hate on Marcy Long. And think of uh, June Long, her, uh, her husband. But as easy as it is to hate on them for their characters, they're actually pretty well fleshed out and built because if you know their story, dude, it's it's actually very sad. Dude. They lost their, go their kid, their son, uh, during the whole Quincy situation. And, and now they're literally distraught. Well, June is distraught. He's very torn and broken. He's a broken man. He lost his son. You know what I mean? And June or uh, uh, Marcy, she's hiding her pain with anger, uh, which is a very common thing to see, dude. You know what I mean? A lot of people hide their pain with anger. It's not the healthiest way to handle all that kind of stuff, but doesn't change the fact that there is potentially millions upon millions of people out there that do the same but yeah i don't know i don't i don't really mind it i i guess i could sympathize for their whole situation seeing as i have kids of my own you know now but i wouldn't know how i would feel if you know god forbid that anything like that ever happened to me but don't forget the oh, price we paid to get this far stop pushing me marcy Let's move out i'm all trying to get course. your back right now all right Get close everyone Alright, let's probably get our weapon ready just in case someone wants to get froggy, you know? Alright, we're on this march. Luckily though, we started the game right outside of Vault 111 in our home city or town of Sanctuary, which is where we're going. 
So luckily for us, it's not very far now, is it? Look at all these dead bodies, man. I destroyed these guys. Did I take the key off of this guy? That thing out. First time I've seen one of yep. these things up close. I'm very glad it's already dead. Let's get out of my way, Preston. I'm trying to get in my power armor, all right? All right, let's go. You know what? For aesthetics purposes, I'm going to put on this thing. Oh my god, you guys are stuck. You're stuck because the car is in the way, Preston. Hurry up. Just go around it. Oh my god, Preston. You are a maniac. You're a maniac. Maniac. How many is it? Two, fours. It's six of us. Oh, dude, no one's going to mess with us. A guy in power armor and a freaking minigun. A minute man with uh, his own laser rifle. An attack dog. Oh, we're in, we're in good hands. I feel like the Allstate commercial guy now. This game is seriously amazing. The gameplay is so much fun, dude. We're running low on ammunition, dude. We only have two hundred or uh, four hundred and forty more rounds. But you know who doesn't know that? The enemies. I can't say I'm gonna miss this festering boil on the ass end of the Commonwealth. <laughs> uh, no offense if you're from here or something. <laughs> Don't worry about it, Sturgis. I am from here, but I get it. Don't worry, Jerry. Just stay with me. It'll be fine. Oh. oh okay. Uh, it's it's really it's really sad. Nuka Cola, have a nuke. <laughs> I have a T-shirt exactly with that quote. It has says Nuka Cola, and then have a nuke, just like that. That exact same logo. It's one of my favorite shirts to wear because it's fun. It's kind of funny. Where are you going, Sturgis? You stop humming. You're gonna bring attention to us. Looks like we got a bunch of places we haven't discovered yet. Like that place over there. I think that's, um, if I remember correctly, I think it's called Abernathy Farm or something. Well, look at that. I think I just found my new vacation home. It's my house, right Sturgis. Heaven, eh, Sturgis. Could be some good salvage in there. Let's get the sanctuary first, though. Probably not. We're close. I do like this place, though. This place is actually pretty cool. But if we're already at the Red Rocket, that means we're pretty much already here. How you guys doing? You guys fine? Come on, Mama Murphy. You need to be somewhere in the middle, man, so we can protect you. You never know what's going to be coming. Alright. Do I have a level up? I don't. How much further? Oh, do I have a long way to go before I level up? Honestly, the next level up, I think I'm going to put it into Charisma so I can invest it in, uh, what is it called? Local Leader? Uh, yeah, Local Leader. So I can establish supply lines, dude. That shit will come in handy. Ready, guys? Well, I'll be damned. It's the monument to the original Minutemen. I knew that was somewhere around Concord. That means this right here must be the Old North Bridge, where the first shots of the American Revolution were fired. I'd call that the best omen I've seen since we left Quincy. Hell yeah. I don't know what you're talking about, boss, but I'm glad you're happy about it. <laughs> uh, we I'm should be good to go here. To come with us. I should have listened to Mama Murphy all along. A pretty nice place she's found for us. I think we could settle down here. Make it a place to call home. What do you think? I mean, yeah. I mean, I used to live here, so it's definitely not a bad place. Yeah. I used to like living here. Before the war. What do you mean? Before what war? Are you saying... Yeah, dude. 200 years ago, bro. What do you think? I lived here over 200 years ago. I was frozen or something for most of it. Just woke up a little while ago. 
Damn. Like one of those old pre-war ghouls. You say you were frozen. Anybody else make it out with you? Just my son, man. My son. Somebody took him away while I was still trapped. I've been looking for him. Damn. I'm sorry. I hope you find him. Let me know if there's any way I can help. Anyway, I am glad you're here. <laughs> this awkward pause. I hope you don't mind. <laughs> but I've got another favor to ask. I've had word from a settlement asking for help. There's still hope in there are Minutemen out there somewhere. The only chance to start rebuilding the Minutemen is to show people that they can count on us when they need us. Trouble is, I've got my hands full here. Do you think you could go help out with the settlement? Yeah, no, of course. I'd be glad to help. That's fantastic. The Minutemen could use more people like you. By the way, if you want to help out around here at all, talk to Sturgis. I'm sure he'd be glad for all the help he can get. All right, well, let's go talk to Sturgis really fast. Oh, we got to level up. So that means this is going into Charisma. Um, honestly, at some point, I'm going to put two more in Charisma. Well, maybe one more plus the bobblehead so that I can have uh, eight Charisma, right? Let me see. I have one, two, three, four, five, six. Yes. Uh, eight charisma so I can get inspirational so later on not right now uh, later on in the gameplay I'm gonna start doing uh, what is it called uh, some some uh, companion leveling if you will right now for a while at least I think I'm just gonna roll with dog meat right, let's go ahead and run and park this baby back in back in the uh, power armor station over here by the house well first things first though Sturgis talk to me buddy Sturgis to do some work here, kid. Your energy is tied um, to this place. Yes? I'd be glad to help. Just tell me what you need. <laughs> well, for starters, we could use some real beds. We've been sleeping on the ground for too long. Just make sure we can sleep with a roof over our heads. Some of these old houses still look solid enough to do the trick. There's a workbench over there you can use. Give me a holler if you need anything. Okay, sounds good. So, we need to build some beds. If I remember correctly, it's some food, water, beds, and some security or some shit like that. Like defenses. Let me out of here. Let me take this before our June or anybody. Can I, can I fix this? Yes, I can. Here, put this back on. Equip. There we go. But what was the other thing that was broken? It was one of the legs, I think. So this does 22, this one, repair. There we go. Now my power armor is, I mean, not tip top shape, but as good as it's gonna be for a while. All right, let's go help these guys out real quick. Get out of my way. Oh my God, Sturgis. All right, we'll start in here. We'll clean out this bathroom. We'll call this one of their rooms. How many people are here? There's. Five, so we need five beds minimum. All right, we'll do this. All right, so furniture, beds. We'll just put them on the floor. <laughs> oh, no, I don't have enough cloth. How much cloth do I need? Oh, dude, I need a lot of cloth. All right. So, uh, I think... We'll put that up or whatever so that people can actually sit down around here. You know what I mean? All right. That the death long conquered was bad news, huh, Mama? You ever seen one of those fuckers be before? Oh, sure. Plenty. One time, I killed a death claw all by myself. <laughs> I feel like that was a jab to me. You telling me you killed a death claw with one bullet? Come on. What do you take me for? <laughs> I might not look it, but back in the day, I the shot. Mama Murphy is or seriously crazy. Yep. Alright, well, first things first. Let's go around and uh, an easy way we can get steel or a uh, cloth is by just getting rid of these 
uh, things or whatever. All right, let's see. How many can we make now? Beds. Nope. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. I think we have enough. I think we need just 15. Alright, so we'll put this... Uh, for June and Marcy Long. So that at least a couple... Can have their own beds, you know what I mean? And then all three of these guys... Can sleep in here. Hey, June. You hanging in there? Oh, wow. Well, you? So. Every day I get up and tell myself. There. You just have to get through today. Where's Marcy? Where's your wife? The worst. Just, uh. I don't know if there's anything I can do to help. Oh. Where the hell is his wife? Yeah, hey, uh. I know I haven't been pulling my weight around here. And. And I'm really trying to do better. Uh, well, all right. All right, so next thing we need to do, we need resources. So one thing's for sure, we need water. So let's go ahead and drop this. We'll put this right here. Maybe. All right, fuck it. Right there is fine. And uh, how much does this do? This does three water, and we need five, so... Here, we'll put another one out back. There we go. Nope. And then we're gonna need food. So do I have anything to put down? So I got some melons. Oh god, that's all I got. But I got an idea. Let's go ahead and take some of these melons Seems over here. Well. Um, that melon. We got a gourd over here. Is that everything? Yeah, I think so. Alright, so let's go back into the build, settlement build menu or whatever. And put all of this stuff down. Alright, we'll put that right there. That, I don't really care where anything goes to be honest, as long as we have enough food. So, there you. You're assigned to food, good. And then you, with well, the real reason why I wanted you, so that I can actually put you in bed with your husband, so that someone else isn't sleeping with your husband. That would be pretty weird, wouldn't it? Oh, wait, I have five. So now i got to build defenses, right? So defenses. Uh, so I don't have circuitry or gears. But what I can do, this produces two. Well, this produces six. So let's go ahead and uh, drop this. Hey, God work. Yes, right sir. there. You never. No. Nope. me over for tea. That's actually a creation club thing, I think. I gotta find. I kind of want June to be the uh, the defense guy. The only reason I wouldn't put Sturges is because he, for some reason, likes to go around and just hammer walls down so it's kind of pointless because he never actually uh, guards anything you know um whoops no damn it where the hell is June I mean it's nighttime shouldn't they be in bed And you know what I'm gonna do too? I'm gonna actually give him my uh my minigun, dude. Let's go ahead and just there he is, I found him. June, come here. You gotta be the protector and the savior of this town, alright? You have been entrusted with security. And just like that, we should be done, because I think we got all three. Nah bro, that little pipe pistol ain't hey, hey. just Ain't gonna do. Do you have a moment? I wanted to thank you for helping us out in Concord. If only we'd run into you sooner. Uh, don't mention it, buddy. Don't mention it. You guys have been through hell, huh? You have no idea. In these past few months, we've lost everything. My son, he's... He's gone. 
What's his name? Your son. What was his name? Kyle. My son's name was Kyle. Yeah, dude, I believe me. I lost my wife and someone kidnapped my son, man. I understand completely, dude. I understand how you feel. I lost someone, too. But you and I, we're still here, right? We have to go on. For them. Absolutely, man. Here, come Let's here, trade. though. I want to give you something. All right, let's start with this mini gun. It's a uh, five millimeter, right? Yep, five millimeter. So let's go ahead and come back on this direction. You're not taking the whole freaking 440, though. Some days are harder than others. No wait. But even the hard days get easier than the one before. Just wanted to trade a few things. I gotta make sure he equips it. There Dude, you go. Please, just. I, I need to be alone right now. I I completely understand, bro. Don't worry, I got you. Um. For now, though, I want to get rid of these things. Uh, maybe in between videos, dude, I kind of want to go around because it takes forever to scrap everything in this settlement because this settlement is pretty freaking big, dude. So, um, I wonder, hold on. I wonder if I build another one, if, if he eventually patrols it too, you know? Let's see, uh, defense, does it go 12, maybe? Okay, so this one isn't guarded. But what I will do is still build another one regardless. I'll put it... Oh god, if I can get over here. So that one's looking in that direction. I want one to be looking in this direction. Oh, do these things... Oh, cool. I didn't know that you could do that. That's really cool, actually. Alright. Well, it's just gonna have to do with six defense. Oh, wait. I don't have enough food. Um... No. Alright, well, let's see really fast if any of these things we've planted have produced anything. I mean, I think it's pretty obvious that the answer is no. But uh, I do know that that farm does, in fact, have stuff. Preston, that's on you, buddy. Uh, we're going to get radiated, but I don't care. I'm going to run through here anyways. Dog meat, where are you? Let's go ahead and get my laser musket. All right, good. We're in a good position now. Dog meat. Dog meat. Uh, dog meat's gone, bro. Did I just hear dog? Oh, that's just dog meat. Woo, I got scared. Oh. What's up? Very nice. That freaking dog, I mean, uh, Blowfly thought he could do something to me. Wait, hold on. So, I gotta pick these up fast. Because they like to disappear. Hell yeah. Very nice. So, let's come over here. We had three, so I need two, four. I just need four of whatever it is. Okay, so he's got tattoo plants. Dope. Oh, look at the kitty. One. Hey. No. Two. Three. Four. That should be enough tattoo plants, to be honest. Well, while we're here, let's go ahead and talk to Mr. Abernathy. Wherever he is. Um. Nope, that's not him. There you are. Hey, talk to me. Excuse me. That's close enough, stranger. We're a peaceful farm. We don't want any trouble. I just want to know how you got out of bed so fast. But, for your concern, I'm friendly. It's okay, I'm friendly. Not looking to cause any trouble. If you say so, but be warned, we're armed here. So don't try anything. Let me tell you, farming ain't easy. Out in the field all day, every day? 
And every minute of it spent watching you back. Uh, what do you grow? What kind of crops do you grow here? Mostly potatoes so far, but we're starting on melons. Blake Abernathy. It's been ages since I've seen one of those vault suits around. You new to these parts? Yeah, I mean, you could say so. I'm... yeah, you could say that. Good to see a new face. How about you? Ever think about working the land? Uh, what's involved? What do you need to start up a farm? Well, my father would have told you it's the three L's. Land, labor, and love. You gotta have land to work, you gotta put in a full day's labor, and you gotta love what you do. Anyone who doesn't ain't gonna last long. Word I of advice, that. though. If you do start up a farm, be ready to deal with the raiders. Why do all the hard work when you can just take what you want at gunpoint? Yeah, that sounds terrible, dude. Sounds like bad news to me. You really are new to these parts. Best armed bastards in the Commonwealth. You have something they want, they won't hesitate to take it. Last time those raiders hit us, my daughter Mary tried to stand up to them. Now she's buried out back of the house. Damn. Only 21 years old, and they shot her down without a thought. That's why we need the Minutemen back. And the sooner, the better. Uh, the Minutemen actually, you know, we're try we're, I mean, it's kind of still there? Minutemen? So you know them then. You mean Preston Garvey's Any idea Garvey's why they haven't been around so much lately? Um, I don't know what happened there, but they both talked at the same time. In Sanctuary. He's over in Sanctuary, trying to rebuild the Minutemen. You don't say. That's close by. If he'd only been there earlier, Mary may still be alive. I don't have much to offer, but those raiders that killed Mary, they took her locket too. It's been in Connie's family for generations. If you could get it back, it'd mean a lot to us. Yeah, man, don't worry about it. I got it. Where are they? Uh, do you know where they're coming from? Yeah, pretty sure I do. One of them mentioned Olivia while they my guess is they're holed up in that old USAF station. Alright, sounds like we got a... A new quest. Very nice, but first things first, I kind of want to go back to Sanctuary and plant these remaining crops so that we can... What is it called? First Steps? Um, yeah, First Step. No, wait. No, that's not it. We're doing Sanctuary. Alright. It says to talk to Sturgis, but they want us to talk to Sturgis after every single phase. Oh, shit. Dogmeat, I need your assistance. Oh, God. Come on, baby. Oh shit, I'm screwed. <laughs> Let me recharge my shit at least, dude. Fuck, who taught you how to fight fair? Dead. Good job, dog meat. Let's go. We almost died there. Thank God we didn't, right? Alright, as soon as we cross over into property territory, we're going into settlement build mode. Uh, I think it's now. There we go, we got some tattoos. Yes, I know it's called tatoes, but I like calling them tattoos. Don't ask me why. Alright. Let's come in this direction. We'll put some tatoes right here. A potato right here, potato right here, and one right here, and we should be all good to go. Let's see, five. There, uh, no wait, four. Come on, baby, five. There we go. So we should be good. Where's Sturgis? Sturgis, buddy, talk to me. I got something to tell you. Oh yeah, I forgot her husband's security guard. <laughs> hey, Sturgis. Why can't you get up like Mr. Abernathy did? I like it. Having a place to sleep will improve everyone's spirits. What we need now is a reliable source of clean water. I'm already done. I'm on it. Clean. Great. Right. Oops. Hey, Sturgis. I feel better already. 
knowing we have a reliable supply of clean water. I hope you don't mind me asking for some more help, but our food supplies are running low. If we're gonna settle here, we'll need to get some crops established. Uh, I'll get it started. I'll start right away. And by Good that, deal. I mean I'm done. Hey, Sturgis. <laughs> this place is starting to feel like home. Now that we can grow our own food, I think we can really make a go with this. Trouble is, the more we establish ourselves here, the more of a target we become. What we need is to get some defenses set up. Then maybe Preston will be able to relax a little bit. Yep, I'm on it. I'm on it. Ah, thanks. It'll make everyone feel more secure here. By the way, hey, Sturgis. I'm done. Thanks for doing that. <laughs> we'll all sleep better at night knowing we have some defenses set up. It's been a long road. But yeah, I think this is it. Home. Feels good. I'm glad to help. Uh, I'm help. glad to help. Well, I appreciate it. Of course you know you're welcome anytime. My door is always open to you. Windows too. Some of the walls actually come to think of it. <laughs> I guess I better get back to it. Take care now. See you later, Sturgis. Mama Murphy. Does she want me to build a chair yet? I don't know why I like building her her chair. You're tied to this place, kid. Your energy. Yeah, I lived here. I used to live here. A long time ago. Ah, but the distant past ain't so distant for you. I saw you leave that icebox. This whole world is like some bad dream you can't wake up from, isn't it? The site can help you, kid. It always has answers. Just gotta bring me some jet so I can see what it wants to tell you. Don't I have... Alright, I'll find I'll some. see if I can find some. My hero. So... No chariot. Tracking. Alright. Um... Looks like we got a little bit of a rad storm going on around here. Oh god, I'm stuck. I don't know where Preston is though. But we should definitely at least equip... Uh... Well, returning the favor is literally en route over there, but... We'll do that once we get to it. But I think for now we're definitely going to call it a video. Um... It is really loud because of this storm, so I'm probably going to have to edit down the sound a little bit. But uh, for now, we're definitely going to call it a video. If you enjoyed this video, do me a huge favor. Drop a like on the video. Subscribe to the channel if you're uh, not already subscribed because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, catch you guys in the next video. Deuces.